And today, I've got some more Robinson's Requiem. Now, last time we, uh, we had emerged from this, uh, into this jungly forest area, and I started killing some lizard men, and I believe that's probably what I'm going to be doing for most of this episode. But, of course, first one has to find lizard men to kill them. And, oh, okay, I seem to be surrounded. I've got to be very careful about how I proceed here. Okay. And the other one is right here. Oh. I can't wait to start using my bow, though. It should be a lot faster and more, um, a lot safer killing these guys, I think. But, now I can skin these guys. I should be able to make a lizard skin equipment soon, and I think that should be better for survival in uh, warm climates, such as the one that I seem to be in now. It should be a lot safer. It should, uh, it should get, like, wet more, um, rarely? It, it should make survival a bit easier in certain environments, I think. But of course, first, I'm going to need to skin a lot more lizards. And I'm also not entirely sure how to make sure that I only make the certain piece of clothing that I want, as opposed to just however much, uh, however much of the material I have. Because the more you have, the more, like, the bigger the clothing it'll make, from what I understand. So let's check that map, see where we haven't gone yet. Seem to have explored a lot of this eastern part of the map already. Maybe I can snake my way down here a bit. Uh, I've been down here. Oh! Okay, there we go. There's a lizard man right there. Are there others, though? None that I can see. Alright. These guys will really sneak up on you behind those trees, too. They're pretty easy to spot, but it doesn't mean... It doesn't mean you'll get them every time. Okay. Now, I suspect... Uh, my character may be a bit... Hungry and possibly thirsty. Oh, just thirsty. Okay, that's actually worse. I don't have any water right now, and I don't know where I can find some. I will eat a bit of meat, though. That can't hurt. Alright. That actually helped a bit. Okay. What's up with that? Like, seriously. Do you just get, like, a little bit of liquid from that meat? I don't know. That confuses me, but whatevs. Alright, alright. I've already explored a bit down here, but there seems to be more. Yeah, I definitely haven't been here. Okay, okay. Let's see, what, what's over here? Oh, this is completely new to me. I don't think I even explored this last time I played this game. Oh, this must be a cave over here? Ah, cave. Interesting. Okay, I'll have to remember this, because I'm going to come back eventually. But not now. I've got other stuff to do. Okay. Um, I want to see if I can collect leaves from this plant here. Is it leaves? Yeah, it's leaves. Okay. I'm not particularly interested in leaves. But it is what it is. Alright, let's see. Okay. Any more lizard men over here? Doesn't look like it. How about over here? I can, I can feel them. I can feel them over here. I can feel the lizard men. I can feel them. They're just waiting for me. Okay, I don't think there are any lizard men. Mo try to move towards that little uh, glowing dot that tends to mark objectives. However uh, vague that the scripter may be. Is this also going to give me leaves, I wonder? Let's find out. It sure is. Okay, I'm not particularly interested in that. I do, however, want to try making clothing out of this. Okay, I've got some, some reptile skin trousers. I think I'll put them on now. It should make it a little bit cooler, I think? I don't know. Pro I would think it'd be cooler. I don't. I don't imagine reptile skin is too uh too hot. Probably allows a lot of room to breathe. Uh, I think it'd be pretty comfortable in this kind of environment. Um, once I can kill some of those tigers, I can make some tiger skin. That that should be really good for colder environments. Okay, there's clearly a lizard man right there. Oh, oh my God. Okay. I. I feel like I should save before killing that. Um, I have no idea what that is. And I seem to have lost my orientation. Uh, I think it was this way? 
Okay, yeah. Wait. Oh god, there are multiple ones. Okay, whatever. I'll save. Do to do. There we go. Okay. Now I'll kill it. What is it? Jeez. Can I use my knife? On? Oh. Okay. What did that do? An infected hand by venomous bite. Level of blood poisoning. Okay, it's a weak blood poison. It's unfortunate that I got uh, poisoned by that, but it's not... I don't think it's too bad. I think it's just gonna... Maybe I should use some anti-venom. Let's see if I have that kind of stuff. Bottle of morphine. Couldn't hurt. Bottle of anesthetic. Bottle of anti-venom. Serum. Okay. I better... Uh, I think I should probably do that. Okay. Stick that in my inventory. And then use it. Oh, wait. There we go. Okay. Robinson doesn't seem to like um, needles very much. Neither do I, actually. Okay, it's now it's now insignificant. I think I handled that pretty well, if I do say so myself. So, I'm thinking I'm probably going to want to stay away from those things until I know a bit more about them. Perhaps some uh, benevolent YouTube commenter will inform me the basics of what I should know. But for now, I'm going to stay away from them. I feel like even if I do kill it, it'll probably just like release toxins into my respiration system. Respiratory system. Whatever. Oh, is that a person? It's a woman, I think. Hey, what's up, babe? How you doing? Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. What the fuck? Okay, well, she's clearly hostile. She's actually annoyingly agile as a fighter. Okay, well, I'm pretty sure I just made it so that I can't collect any of her crap. Oh, here we go. Another knife. And that's all I can get from her, it seems. Can I use my knife on her and steal her delicious flesh? Maybe cut her breasts off and use them as uh, morale enhancers. Okay, they're clearly a bunch of them. And they all seem to be female, from what I can see. Alright, I'll steal all the knives, can't hurt. Uh, what kind of damage did she do to me, though? That's what I need to know. Infection, level of seriousness, benign. Okay, that should... That sh I should probably bandage it, though. Um, it is turning night, and I'm not particularly happy about that. But I get a feeling it probably doesn't rain here too often. Uh, I will bandage my ch- well... I don't think I even need to bandage it. I think... I don't know, it seems fine. Oh look, it's already healed itself. Weak. Alright. Uh, actually, I think I will go in that one cave. Yeah, that's- that's a ways- oh. Oh, is it the corpse? Well, what is this? Yeah, it's the corpse, okay. <laughs> I'll I'll head over to that cave. It's pretty far away, but I think it's fucking elephant over here. Jeez, I think it's best to be safe through the night as opposed to taking that risk of staying outside. Who knows what kind of crazy diseases I could catch? I could be raped in my sleep by one of those cave women and get their crazy syphilis diseases and such. And I definitely don't want that. And I don't think you guys want that either. <laughs> Actually, I don't know. I might kind of want that. Depends. Let's see. Depends on whether or not they're actually human, I think. Okay, cave should be right around here. I'm tempted to sprint there, but I think it's probably... Oh, jeez, I'm about to die of thirst. Okay, I might have to reload that save, because I have no food and no way of getting food right now. I mean water. Okay. I'll just quickly sleep and then get out. Oh, jeez, this again? Okay, whatevs. Enjoy. Farewell, my fellow explorer. I wonder if I backed the right horse when I contracted you. You look so clumsy and deflated. Nietzsche 26 seems so much more resourceful than you. He has settled in at the bottom of a canyon and has everything he needs. Well, so long. 
Okay, what a bitch. I'm just, like, trying to, like, save her ass or whatever. And she's just like, oh yeah, this other dude, he's so much better than you are. What? Okay, I seem to be stuck in this cave. This is... This is most unusual. Perhaps this cave was actually a trap. Well... Um... Oh. There we go. That was... That was really weird. And don't tell me it wasn't. Anyway. I'm gonna have to call it here, guys. Uh, I'll be sure to hopefully figure some stuff out next time. Hopefully we can uh, figure out what's up with that crazy bitch. Um, but until then, I'll see you guys next time.